How's it going everyone? How are you doing? Welcome back to the channel. I am Josh aka The Lonely Hermit and today we are getting into back into my fire red randomizer nuzlocke for episode do I said two a lot right there. Uh, so I made a boo boo. I made a boo boo and I did not realize it yesterday. So if you remember yesterday when we fought Gary he threw out a squirtle. Uh, I went to go up to Viridian and I went to you know I started recording an episode and I took out a trainer and they had a weedle. And I think a Caterpie or something. And then I went to the next one and they had still bug type, the normal Pokemon they would have. And I realized that the trainers weren't randomized in this one. So I had to go back into the randomized thing I use and not necessarily reroll the whole thing. I was able to keep my Pokemon and all that. But the problem is their abilities did get reset. So obviously Biff has Water Veil. Latifa had now has Drought. Uh, Slip has Speed Boost, which is actually pretty good. I, that was probably the only really good thing to come out of it. Uh, and Disappoint has color change so it was really interesting to see their moves or their abilities get randomized again but yeah i made that big boo boo uh, but that's the team they're all level eight right now we're gonna head into reading forest i'm gonna go ahead and get my first encounter i'm actually gonna throw a slip up front because of yawn i'm gonna go ahead and get my first encounter disappoint is still disappointing by the way I was trying to train it up to see if it would learn any moves. Oh, there's an item. I right, whatever. Uh, I was <laughs> trying to get it to level up and learn moves, but I it got to level eight. Still didn't learn anything. It it only had splash. Now it knows tail whip and synthesis too, uh, but it doesn't even learn anything until level ten. And at level ten, it learns tackle. So all my Pokemon know normal type moves, and the only one I'm okay with is Wismer because it's a normal type. Everyone else has no stab moves right now, so. We'll see. I think Nidoran should learn like Poison Sting soon. Slowbo should learn. S wow. Okay. Baby Pokemon. All right. God, my luck. <laughs> my luck. Oh no. How many Pokeballs do I have? It's it was really annoying when I was grinding going against Jigglypuff. Cause it kept doing that. It kept freaking defense curling. At least this Igly buffs level five. At least it's level five. But uh, what does Charm do? Lower attack, right? Tw minus two attack. Come on. So I got it lower. I'm gonna go ahead and throw a Pokeball. I only have one. I only have one. I mean, if I don't catch Igly buff, I'm not gonna be too to uh upset okay <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna was, i'm not gonna lie i am gonna grade more pokeballs right now though uh what should i name it uh i'm just gonna um, i think i'm gonna i'm gonna name it luck i'm gonna name it luck name her luck because my luck so far has been very up and down with my encounters uh <laughs> so i'm gonna go to a pokemon center real quick actually since i'm here I am also gonna grind Iggly Buff a little bit. I'm gonna get it to like level seven ish or something. See if it learns any moves. So I'll be right back again. So I'm sitting here grinding, and I just realized that I now have two Pokemon that don't have any moves. It just barely registered in my head. Iggly Buff uh, Luck has Sing Charm Defense Core. My luck. Okay, so I got Iggly Buff to level seven. I got Luck. Luck. I call him by the nickname. Got Luck to level seven, and I did not even check its ability. It has Down. Okay. I mean, it's a Pokemon that I can bring in to like sing and then take right back out. Uh, so let's get right into these battles for breeding. I'm gonna try and get to Pewter as quickly as possible today. And let's take on this first trainer. So, I, like I said, I went into Viridian and tried battling these trainers, and they still had their bug type. So it was just like, I, I fucked it, I messed up. And he has a Whooper. Okay. We're not seeing very many Gen 1 Pokemon. We're seeing a lot of like Gen 2 and 3 here. That shouldn't do anything. Okay. So yeah, Slip. Slip's gonna carry us, man. Slip's gonna Slip's gonna be our guy throughout this plate there, can I tell? Especially with speed boost. Oh yeah, so because I was switch training too. Uh oh I didn't see. I didn't see what he had. Um because it was um because I was switch training with Igly Buff, uh everyone else kinda got close to level 9. Uh, unfortunately, it had no moves, so I couldn't like try and grind it. Um, so, it is what it is. Doesn't even learn pound. I look until like level nine. And please don't poison. Please don't poison. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Biff's uproar is actually pretty good. Biff's uproar is pretty good. It's the only Pokemon right now that has a stab move for me, so naturally that is gonna be its best move. Uh, it's kind of ironic, by the way, that he had a Wormpool or she, Scribe Chloe. Okay. 
It's weird, I randomize the trainers, but the models don't change, I guess. I mean, I... I guess that'd be too complicated, huh? <laughs> Scribe... They're all scribes. It's weird. Okay, so slip. I should, honestly, after someone put Biff or... or Latifa. Please don't poison, please don't poison. Okay. I thought it poisoned because it paused there for a second. Uh, why do they all have Wurmples? It's weird. <laughs> it's like perfect. So I posted uh, my first episode on Reddit, right? And I got a comment on it telling me like, hey, it's your first randomizer, you know. Maybe you shouldn't ran- you sh I mean, it's your first Nuzlocke, rather. You maybe you shouldn't randomize it. Uh, and understandable. I totally get it. Probably not the smartest thing to do. Um, but screw it. I mean, I wanted the extra challenge. I wanted to see if I could handle it. If I can't, if this is too difficult, then I'm just going to transition to a regular Nuzlocke playthrough of all the, you know, all the games. Um, but if, if I get, like I said in the first episode, if I get swept before Koga, then I will switch, we'll replay and I'll switch to a regular, just a regular Nuzlocke playthrough. Um, so now we at least have an idea of what's coming. You know, like with these, with these trainers, even right now, I have no idea what's coming. I did turn off legendaries. Uh, to give myself that slight, you know, edge, I guess, uh, to prevent, you know, like a random Mewtwo or something like that. That would end me. Probably that would end me. Uh, I am going to regularly grind. I'm going to take on, like, the first trainer and see and try and gauge, like, about where I need to be. You know, if the first trainer is, like, level 8, then I'm going to try and get my Pokemon to level 8 at least. Uh, I'm going to probably get them to a level over what the trainers are, just one. I won't try to over level too much. Obviously, I might run into some Pokemon that will stall me, that'll have crazy abilities, that'll do all this stuff. Uh, and that's, I, I chose this fate. And I must accept it. <laughs> so, I'm gonna roll with it. Like I said, if I die early, then we're just gonna go ahead and restart with a normal, normal Nuzlocke playthrough. I'm gonna go ahead and throw in. I'm gonna throw in luck and just put him to sleep and then switch and I think it's a slip. I'm kind of getting a little over leveled here right now. I think Brock's Onyx was usually around 13, 14. It might have been 15. I think it might have been 14 or 13. Uh, so we're not like crazy over leveled. If anything, we're under leveled. I remember taking on Brock though whenever I would. So my first, I guess, my first official, official starter was Charmander. Of course, basic. Uh, <laughs> it was Charmander, and I remember having to always grind Charmander to Charmeleon so I can get Metal Claw because I would be screwed otherwise. Because there was really no Pokemon that you could get that was strong against Rock types before taking on that gym, unless you had Squirtle or Bulbasaur. Uh, but when you had Charmander, you, there was really nothing. You were weak, so that's why I had to grind to Charmeleon to get Metal Claw because Metal Claw is strong against the uh against his pokemon because steel steel beats rock type okay let's move on yeah, like i said in the first episode i do have a lot of nostalgia for this game the music especially the music it's one of the main reasons why i bought let's go let's go pikachu and eevee it's because of the music the remastered not so 8-bit anymore music uh i, I loved it i loved, 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 loved it uh, hearing it again in you know modern form although let's go wasn't the most Ex I missed? <sighs> Although Let's Go wasn't the most exciting game in the world, uh, it was really easy, but, you know, having that nostalgia again was cool, and having it, you know, remastered on the Switch, even though, like I said, it was it was easier, was pretty cool. I, I really enjoyed that game. I hope they do come out with, like, a Let's Go Togepi and uh, Azuro or something. I think that'd be cool. Um, I know they said that they wouldn't, but I'd be pretty excited to see that, because Playing through Gen 2 in like a basic version, it's it's a good entry point. You know, I know a lot of people weren't happy with Let's Go, especially you know after we had that break of not getting anything, and then we get Let's Go. You know, but I think I, I think for what it needed to do, it did well, and that was introduce people who you know only play like Pokemon Go, introduce them into sort of main series. Yes, it's a it's a baby step version, but it worked. And it works for trying to introduce people to something that they might not have ever, you know, gotten into. Like, the games, obviously, Pokemon Go compared to, you know, Pokemon like Fire Red or any of the main series games is a huge jump. It's a huge leap. It's completely different 
And so that's a good way to try and introduce people into the game, in my humble opinion. I think you battle this person, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is the one that would have Kakuna and Metapod. This was easy level. Easy level in the original game. Easy level. Alright, low tide, leaf man thing. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and tackle. So I didn't even consider that this low tide had absorb. Uh, even though it's not doing anything, it's annoying, is what it is. I'm gonna go ahead and tackle again. I'm running out of PP. <laughs> PP. Uh, <laughs> I'm a child. <laughs> so Slip's gonna go ahead. Damn, they're giving a lot of XP. He's poke all these Pokemon are giving like a hundred. No wonder we're over leveling. I'm gonna throw in Latifah. Another sound current? I just caught that. So I guess the roots the the roots trainers are gonna have similar Pokemon. That kinda sucks. Or maybe the same class. Try! They'll have the same sort of Pokemon. That's interesting. I mean that's not like a normal randomizer, I guess, but that's interesting. Okay, we got one more trainer. One more trainer. Let's use Biff for this one. Can slip so the week. I don't want to have to use a potion because we're basically almost there. And then watch, this person's gonna sweep me. I'm gonna get swept right here by this freaking trainer. Uh, let's see what you got. What you got? What you got? Oh, isn't this a trainer that has Pikachu? I think this is a trainer that has Pikachu. So it's funny that he's Peachy. Uh, this should be easy, right? I hope. Ooh. Oh. I actually did a lot more damage than I thought. Uh, but we one-shot it. Okay. <laughs> that was easy. Alright. So let's head into Palatin. Here we go. I said, I just realized that I said Palatin. I meant Pewter City. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and heal up. I'm gonna go take on the first trainer in the gym. I just want to kind of gauge like what level they are. I want to say Brock's like in the 12 to 14 range so i might do some off screen off screen grinding real quick get them get my pokemon like level 12 uh and then we'll take on the gym okay let's take on this first jader let's see let's see i think this trainer is like 8 10 level 8 level 10 something like that it should be one that i can take on here let's see electric i have biff okay cool um so the electric's level 10 so that means Brock is definitely going to be up there. So, yeah, after this battle, I'm going to go ahead and off-screen grind for a little bit. Take a second to just sit there and grind and get to, like, level 12. I'll probably get to, like, 12 just to not make it super easy. Uh, but this Electron's kind of being annoying. Oh, cool. Crit. Crit! <laughs> Screw you, Electron. Damn, 222? Oh, my God. And, oh, Astonish. That's actually decent just in case we run into any ghost type. Uh, Grimer, 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 nasty freaking Grimer, disgusting Grimer. Uh, <laughs> I wonder what the, what the, like, sometimes I, I just wonder, like, with some of these Pokemon that they've come up with, like, I mean, you have the obvious, like, easy ones, you know, like, Clef Key, it's just a, a keychain, right? But you have, like, like, Grimer. What did you think in your head that it was supposed to, like, it's that, you just thought, it has static, really? Uh, where you just thought, I'm gonna make a Pokemon... That's sludge. Like, it's literally just sludge with eyes and a mouth. You know, where in your mind did you think, like, I'm gonna make a sludge Pokemon? You know, it's like, it's whoa, crit. But in my, I always think about that with certain Pokemon. Like, where did you get that idea from? Like, where did that idea come from? You know, I, I, I that might just be me. I don't know. Um, I'm sure it's not just me, but I just find that funny sometimes. Like, some of the Pokemon are just like, where did you get that idea from? Like, where in your, when did it pop in your head? Like, yeah, I'm gonna make a sludge Pokemon with eyes in the mouth. I know it was Gen 1, it was early, and they were coming up with a lot of weird designs and stuff, and they had to be a bit different, but I just, I always found that funny, and like, certain designs are just like, where did, I mean, I guess you could say that for every single Pokemon, like Slip, like Silver, you know, like, what did it say, well, Curse? Okay, I thought I used Tackle. Um, like Slip, you know, uh, what is Slowbro even? And I think that's the beauty of Pokemon. Like a lot of these Pokemon are just like, what it even is it? Uh, some of them who aren't really based off animals or who are kind of based off animals but have a, like a cool twist, you know, a really cool twist on them. Uh, like Abra, I think Abracadabra and Alakazam. I didn't even know if they were supposed to be like a cat or you know, something like that. Um, but yet they're like psychic and stuff. <laughs> like, you know, I think that's the beauty of what makes like Pokemon special, you know, it makes it. 
and it poisoned me. Ah! Ooh, so so low. Ah, they're both paralyzed, man. I'm going to Biff. I'm going to Biff. Ooh, I'm gonna use uproar. Wait. Oh yeah, I had Nidoran, huh? I forgot why the why the sun was up. Ooh, that does a lot of damage, dude. This Grimer's doing work. I might. Am I gonna? If he crits, I might die right here. If he crits, I might die. died <laughs> Dude, his, it's a harden man Ugh, come on come on come on kill him please finish him he disabled my freaking scratch oh my god this grimer is annoying I'm gonna I'm gonna growl I'm just gonna keep growling it I, there's no point in tail whipping it I think it's already plus five on defense or plus six, actually. It's probably already max, so... I'm just gonna try and make it so it at least can't hit me. You know, I, although I can't really hit it. I'm gonna make it so I, he can hit me. Oh, already? I was about to skip ahead, but... Oh, I thought he crit me. I was about to skip ahead. Are you kidding me? Come on! I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. Okay. No, come on! Come on! I'm gonna heal... Uh, can, this is already bad. I can only imagine how Brock's gonna be in about three minutes. Easy dubs. We win. GG. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This this is gonna kill. Just don't, don't get paralyzed. Don't get paralyzed. Okay. Hey, finally. Jeez, everyone's gonna get some XP too. Uh, the Latifa is level 11. That'll make grinding a bit easier. Okay, slip. Didn't level up. <laughs> cool. <sighs> okay, so like I said, I'm gonna go heal, and then I'm. <gasps> Wait. Oh, almost forgot. Slip's poison. Slip would have died. Slip would have died. Slip would have died. Slip would have died. Oh, <laughs> almost forgot. Okay, I'm gonna go grind. I'll be right back. Okay, so I sat there for like 10 minutes grinding. Everyone's up to scratch now. Slips level 13, Disappoint, Biff, Luck, and Latifa are all level 12. Uh, disappoint and Luck learn. I think Disappoint learned Tackle, Luck learned Pound, so it made it so much easier to grind through that. So we're gonna go ahead, jump into this fight, and I'm gonna lead with Slip, and I'm gonna see if I can set up, if I can get some curses going. He did learn. Uh, water gun in the meantime and Nidoran did learn double kick so we have some stuff to do with some other Pokemon but we're gonna go ahead and head right into it this is a first gym match. Ah, first gym battle let's go all right you probably not oh, actually you might have rock types I don't know I kind of hope he has rock types because that'll make this way easier but if he doesn't that's cool let's see let's see let's see oh gym music hold on oh 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 Okay, okay. God damn it. <laughs> uh, who do I go back into? I think I go into Biff. I'm going to Biff. Can't set up on this. I'm just asking to get freaking. Oh, why did it? Why does every electric type of thunder wait? <laughs> Even though it makes perfect sense. Let me use up. Oh my god. And he has supersonic. Come on. Dude, 
hey, this I love the music. I'm sorry, I love the music in Fire Loop Green. I freaking love the music in Fire Loop Green. I'm gonna I'm still gonna go back into slip for this one because Uh yeah. Butterfree, what can Butterfree realistically do? Just put him to sleep. I guess that's probably the worst. So I'm gonna put it to sleep. <laughs> Please don't confuse me. I should do yeah, I was gonna say that should do nothing. Okay. Easy dubs, we win. GG. GG, we win. This is gonna be easy. So, do we outspeed it already? No. Okay. Don't confuse me, don't confuse me, don't confuse me, don't confuse me. Okay. Alright. Butterfree's gonna go to sleep. Oh, uh, GG. Oh, it doesn't crit. That's where we're gonna take a couple hits from here, but. GG, we got it for gym badge. GG, GG, GG. This is a totally legit. I'm. Uh, this is just for show. I'm actually playing on the Game Boy. Uh, this is this is um just for show. This is not uh, anything, by the way. Uh, so we're gonna water gun, and there we go. Okay, okay. Here, let me spam through this. Spam through this. Level 14, baby. That was 480 XP. Jeez. Champion Joe. We beat the champion. We beat the game. We beat the game. We beat the game. We beat the game. Guys, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it. Beat the game, you beat the game. I did it, I did it. I'm a master at Nuzlocke, we beat the game. We beat the game, we beat the game, we beat the game. We beat the game, we beat the game. I don't even have to play the rest of this. We beat the game, we beat the game. We won. Thank you, thank you. Uh, thank you guys for watching. This was um, the whole series, Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. Uh, I beat the game. We have officially been in record time in less than an hour. We have beaten Pokemon Fire Red. I think that's a new world record. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. But I got my title. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we got our first gym badge though. That is an accomplishment. We're through the first gym leader. Let's go. Okay. Chinchu and Butterfree. What a combination, bro. Good job. 1400. Dallas. TM39. I think the TMs are randomized. I don't think TM39 is Rock Tomb. Cosmic. <gasps> Wait, Cosmic Power is good, right? That's like the setup one. Oh, uh, wait, it's a defensive one. Oh, okay. I'll probably throw that on slow, bro. Or slip. I gotta remember to call them by their names. <laughs> it's just mean to not call them by their names. Okay, but yeah, we beat... We'll go ahead and skip ahead here to the Pokemon Center. We have officially beaten the first gym. And we'll be heading to Mount Moon in the next episode. We'll go ahead and get our encounter on, on the next route, I think, to the right. We'll get our encounter in Mount Moon. We'll make it all the way to Cerulean. We'll probably take on Nugget Bridge, if time permits. I'm, I'm sure we'll have time to take on Nugget Bridge. And I don't think we'll take on Misty tomorrow, though. We'll probably take on Nugget Bridge, though, for sure. And yeah, so that was my second episode of my Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Nuzlocke playthrough. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. Go check out the socials in the description, my Twitter and Instagram. They're both, I believe, at HermitLonely. Uh, please go check those out. Go drop a follow. And yeah, if you guys, like I said, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe. I have been the Lonely Hermit, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.